Hi everyone, it's Missy. So, it's Saturday and I went back to the same store I was at yesterday. Everything was still there like how I left it. So, I went back and I bought everything that I wish I would have grabbed yesterday. I got all the Viva pop-ups. I got all the Reynolds wrap. I got all the Angel Soft toilet paper and yes, that was a clearance, 50% clearance um, price. So I grabbed the last three of those on the top shelf. I also f was dig took the time to dig because I didn't have time yesterday. And I got the brownie paper towels. There was two shop towels. I just grabbed one. Um, the Clorox disinfectant wipes, you know, and the Dove bar soap over here was tucked in the very back. And then, of course, I had the chapsticks. So, I'm just going to quick go over some prices so that way you guys can figure it out. So, the Reynolds Wrap Heavy Duty, it has to be the 37 and a half foot, um, half square feet. And this, like, is extra wide. This has a sticker of $3. When they go and ring it through the register, it rings up as $2.25. And so, 50% off is $1.13 each. And I have five of those there. The Viva pop-ups, they don't have a sticker on them, but they are the 60 count one ply. Um, let's see if there's a UPC code. I found more in the regular aisle. Okay, here's a UPC code. And those are ringing up for uh, $1.35. And they said that that is... So, uh, this one has a sticker right here, $2.70, and the other ones didn't, because um, they were from the regular aisle, but they are all ringing up $1.35, so that's your 50% clearance there. The brownie paper towels, those were $1.55, and those ring up as $0.70. Cents. The Scott shop towels, these ones right here. Um, the sticker says two dollars and thirty eight cents, and it rang up as a dollar sixteen. Uh, the Angel Soft, those were in the overstock section. Those were originally seven dollars and sixty five cents, but they're ringing up as three dollars and eighty four cents each, and that's for the nine. Mega rolls equals 36, the 480 plus sheets. I'll give you the UPC on that one, because that one was in the regular aisle too. So that's the UPC code there. All right. And then the Dove. So the sticker on that one was $3.15. And he had to, um, nope, this one rang up as $1.57 on its own. I'll give you the UPC code there. Alright, so that way you can, he didn't have to do anything. A lot of things were ringing up correctly today, um, so he didn't have to like override anything too much. So Then I have the Clorox disinfectant wipes. These had the dollar sticker on them and they did ring up incorrectly. He did have to override these, they're 50 cents. I'll give you the UPC code on that. All right, so that's that. And then the chapstick. So there's two different ones here. All right, so they have the stickers of 125 each. Anyway, they're both slightly different packaging, but they each ring up for 45 cents each on their own. He didn't have to enter anything into the system. And this is the UPC code. And then I think it's the same, yeah, it's the same UPC code, but you could tell that the packaging is different. So I don't know what's going on there. They did have the cherry. They also had the original. I didn't buy the original because we only use the cherry in our house, but, um, so check that out as well. And I believe that's it. Now this item here was also in the clearance section. But I think it was misplaced there. It ended up ringing five, $5, and then I had a dollar off coupon, so I paid $4. So whenever you see something like this, that, oh, I think it's clearance and it's not, um, just bring it up front, and they'll do a price check. Um, 
I didn't do a price check because I kind of wanted to get in and out quickly because we were moving on to Family Dollar. I had a group with me that they just wanted me to help them coupon. So, um, but always do a price check. Take the time, do a price check. It will save you in the long run. I do use them though, so I'm not too worried about it, but... Um, yeah, so I was just still shocked at how much stuff that they had there. They still had a lot of conditioners, shampoos, uh, laundry detergent stuff and all that. I don't think, they had no signage at all at the store that said clearance. Yes, uh, the rumors are true. The 5 off 25 digital is not working Saturday morning. But I, what I used was the 5 off 25 uh, paper coupon I got on my receipt from yesterday. That worked fine. So I had no idea until someone else went through the line and it was not working. So just be aware of that. If you have the one from your receipt, go ahead and use that. That works fine. If you have paper coupons, those are working fine. And I heard all the other digital coupons are working. It's just the 5 off 25 store coupon ain't working. So there you have it. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.